The drummer of the rock group Journey was in court in Salem today to face rape and assault charges. Dean Castronova was arrested earlier this month in Salem on a domestic violence case. Chris Holmstrom was at court and joins us live in Salem. Chris. Yeah, Dan and Jennifer, Dean Castronovo is facing some serious charges, and tonight he'll remain here at the Marion County Jail. Journey drummer Dean Castronovo making his first court appearance after being charged with rape. What is the state's position on bail? Coin Six obtained court documents that shows the drummer faces a slew of charges from an arrest earlier this month. They include rape, unlawful use of a weapon, and assault. Authorities were called to Castronovo's home on June 16th. When they got there, they say he refused to come out of the house. But once officers came inside, he surrendered. He was arrested and released on bail and was to have no contact with the victim. But according to the state prosecutor, he contacted the victim several times by phone and sent her more than 100 text messages. Those texts cycling between uh, apologies to threats to kill himself, to telling her that she hates him, um, that he hates her. Then Monday, he was arrested again after a grand jury indictment. The details of the case still unknown. I tracked down fans in Salem to get their reaction. I'm, I'm surprised and a little sad. Fans tell me they don't want to believe it and say he's played a crucial role in the local music community, including giving back to the local Boys and Girls Club. From what little I know, he has donated a lot of his money as well as equipment and time to furthering youth education. In fact, just a few months ago, Castronovo made news at South Albany High School when he donated funds to help the school recover after a devastating fire. The South Salem High School grad says he was heartbroken to learn about the damaged band equipment and wanted to help out. I'm, I'm grateful and honored to be a part of helping to give back along with everybody else. So thank you guys so much. Now a much different tune. Castronovo remains in jail with no bail. That's uh, sad. You know, he donated and helped out the community. and. Now this happens. It's just a bad deal, you know. Hopefully uh, it'll turn out for the better for him. And as for his band journey, I've learned that he's off the band's current U.S. tour and has been replaced with another drummer. He's expected back in court tomorrow morning. Reporting live from Salem, I'm Chris Holmstrom for Coin 6 News. And we should note for our audience, when you see somebody, uh, uh, an inmate, dressed like he was, they only dress people like that when they're concerned that they might try to hurt themselves. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sir.